Welcome back to T-Mobile Arena here in Las Vegas as we are joined here at the desk by the one and only man who doesn't need any introduction. Lil John is with us. Lil John, you are Mr. Vegas. You love this town, don't you? You love this town. Uh, well, Vegas shows me a lot of love. I've been coming to Vegas so many years. I've been working in Vegas so many years. I might as well live here. This is like a second home to me. Yeah, and you're gonna be at Hakkasan tonight. You're gonna yes. at Jewel Nightclub coming up. I mean, you're, yes. you got DJ residencies all over town. Yeah, Hakkasan group's been taking very good care of me. So we're gonna start off the Halloween weekend tonight at Hakkasan and get really crazy. You're making me feel short, man. I'm just gonna stand up. <laughs> Let's hey, so big. That's how I feel Are all the time. Are you this big or is it your chair? I know. That's, that's chair, how I feel chair. all the time sitting yeah. next to him. Let's talk hockey for a second. All I right. know that you got a lot of connections to hockey. Yeah. P.K. Subban. Yeah. But more importantly, you go way back. Not only did you go back, and let's talk about your Atlanta days back then. Uh, yeah, well, I, I started watching hockey when we had the Atlanta Flames. And that's how I got into hockey. And then later on, uh, my son started playing hockey. And I wanted him, this is when we had the Thrashers. And I wanted him to, to go to a real hockey game to see hockey's really, how hockey's really played by grown men, adults. <laughs> and so uh, we went to a Thrashers game and the NHL showed us so much love. The team showed us love. The owners showed us love. And I started to just go to a lot of hockey games. And I even had the Stanley Cup in my car. <laughs> they let me put the Stanley Cup in my car. And how'd man, you get to I, do that? Huh? How'd they let you do that? I got hookups. I got connects. <laughs> You're little John, of course. Yes, man. Course. But I mean, I really love the sport. And today, this game, man, this is yeah. my first time actually being able to come to a, a Vegas Knights game right. and it's four zero so, already. And like, I saw you sitting down there. You're behind the penalty box. Yes. I mean, you're pretty close I'm to the ice. I'm talking crap to everybody to come. Oh, to I, that as well, box. you should be. <laughs> no, but this is your first game here. Honestly, like, how, I mean, because you can watch hockey on TV, right? Which I'm glad that everyone does, by the way. But when you watch it live, it's just live. a completely different experience. Isn't I it? tell all my friends when they ask me about hockey, I'm like. You have to go live and you have to, one, at least once in your life, sit right on the glass. Oh, so man. when someone gets checked <laughs> right on that glass, you're like, oh, or that puck is like right here at your head. The thrill is, is something else, man. And I actually haven't been to a game in some years. So to, to smell the ice today and to be here and see these guys just kicking butt is amazing. And they're not disappointing you today, I'll tell you that. After oh a second period like that, that's phenomenal. Yeah, I mean, it's amazing. A lot of fun. Well, Lil John, thanks for joining us. Thanks for being ambassador for the sport. Lil John is more than gracious, big hockey fan. Thank you, sir, very much. Yeah! <laughs> I didn't even have to cue him up. More, more Intervision Report presented by Toyota when we come back. They're good man.